Understand the summary report. Summary report will have Students' holistic quotient which is nothing but students' percentile score in the test. Is not the score percentage but the percentile. Strong persona traits which show the three topmost persona for the student based on the performance in the test. Top rated skills which are the three skills where the student has performed the best. Top improvement areas which are the three skills where students' performance has been the weakest. Five skill based careers which are the three topmost careers recommended based on the performance in the skill and aptitude test. Interest based careers which are the three topmost careers recommended based on the interests shown by the student. Ages stream selection plot interest vs potential which is only for student up to class 10th. The subjects falling in the topmost quadrant which is marked in blue are the best fit study streams based on the interest shown by the student and the performance in the aptitude test. Note that the stream selection plot will not be available for students in class 11th and 12th as they have already selected a specialization stream. Pages career selection plot interest vis a vis potential. The careers falling in the topmost quadrant which is marked in blue are the best fit careers based on the interest shown by the student and the performance in the aptitude test. The point to note here is that in this report there are 19 career streams and each stream can have multiple careers. Example, career streams such as information technology professional can have careers such as software engineer, business analyst, business consultant, or pre-sales consultant. Section 2. Interpretation of Holistic Skill Mapping section presents students overall holistic quotient or the score percentile based on students performance in the skill and aptitude test example holistic quotient is 68 it means students overall percentile in the skill and aptitude test is 68 on the students performance in the different skill areas a map is also presented on how students relative performance maps to different areas of brain table also presents the scientific meaning of each brain area. 160 degree profile this section depicts students overall quotient in mental, physical, and social awareness based on the performance in the skill and aptitude test. Two of these quotients will give us a good understanding of students 360 degree profile and his strong and weak areas. Pages skill area wise performance. Students' overall skill profile is grouped in total 8 skill areas and the chart depicts students' performance in these 8 skill areas. Skill areas are Well-rounded physical abilities which depicts the extent of physically active and healthy lifestyle. Creative visualization which it denotes the ability to imagine things and create mental images. Imagination which depicts the ability to think originally, independently, and laterally. Critical thinking and problem solving represents the ability to think logically, critically, and analytically. Literacy and communication denotes the command over language and communication. Collaboration represents the ability to work effectively with others on common tasks. And self-discipline and awareness represents students' self-discipline and awareness about the surroundings. Leading vision depicts the ability to engage and motivate people around. Depicts how the student stands out against your peers at the same level. Page shows students area-wise performance compared to the other students at same level or class group. Blue line shows students score and the red line is the median score for the given areas for example creative visualization. Page and next page also shows three strongest and weakest areas for the student can help us in understanding students' overall profile and strong weak areas. Section is your skill profile definition which shows students' overall performance in the 14 identified skill areas. Blue line depicts students' score and the red line is the median score. Comparing the blue dots which shows students' score with the red dots which shows the median score, 
and find out how the student has performed across all these 14 identified skill areas. Section again gives us a very good understanding of students overall skill profile. At the bottom of this page, and also find out three strongest and weakest skills for the student. Section is your persona description which represents students' persona across 10 unique personality dimensions. Position of blue circle on the line shows how the student's persona looks like on a given dimension. Example, realistic imaginative dimension. Blue circle is more towards imaginative persona but not on the complete right which means the student is generally creative and have good imaginative power. For detailed skill-wise report. Section gives the details of students' performance in 14 different skill sets and their comparison with the median score. The blue line depicts students' performance and the red line is median performance. Example here we see that in creativity and innovation skill, student is neither strong nor weak and the score is slightly less than the median. Section 5 is on the skills related learning recommendations for the student. Recommendations are based on the strength and weaknesses the student has shown in 14 different skill areas. Recommendation around 3 skill strengths shows how student can benefit from these strengths. Improvements for you recommendation around other 11 other skills are on how student can work on improving these skills and convert them into strengths. And 6 is Career Recommendation Report. Recommendation is based on Bodami's Artificial Intelligence Algorithm. First recommendation is Top 3 Career which is based on students' performance in the Skill and Aptitude Test. Percentage of match signifies how close students' skillets are vis-a-vis -vis the people currently in in these career fields. Second recommendation is interest-based which shows top three career options based on the interest shown by the student. Third recommendation is combined skill and interest-based which shows the top three career options based on the combination of skill and interest. This page gives the detail of the career option falling in top three. Page has name of the career, bank of the career for the student. Description of the career and student's skill-wise score in comparison with the median skill-wise score of professionals actually working in these career fields. Though a link to the given career option is given towards bottom which takes the student to the detailed career page. Page shows how this given career option can be pursued by the student. For the top three career options, Next page is top hobby areas applicable for the student which shows the top three hobbies which are best match with the student's skill profile. Section 7 is student's fitment rank with other 16 careers which are not in the top three career options for the student. Student has performed really well in the exam, also possible that more than three careers will have 100% fitment for the student. Percentage of match signifies how close students' skills are vis-a-vis -vis the people currently working in these career fields. Students in class 11th and 12th. Will an addition section on careers excluded for you which will show the careers which are not applicable for student based on the current study stream for example. Engineering and advanced science profession is not applicable for students in humanities stream. Section is on career and stream options after 10th or 12th which shows the career and study options for the students after class 10th or 12th. 